Welcome to the Political Science Department. I'm pleased that you're interested in studying at the University of Bamberg, and I'd be delighted to give you a tour around the campus and the town of Bamberg itself. Let's go. My name is Ben, and I'm one of 550 BA students and 170 MA students studying political science at the University of Bamberg. Bamberg is a real university town with more than 12,000 students in a town of 70,000 inhabitants located in the north of Bavaria. At the moment, I'm on my way to a seminar from Heike Klufa. Students are taught in well-equipped classrooms with multimedia devices such as projectors, laptop connections, and DVD players. Free Wi-Fi is also available throughout the campus. One of the big advantages of studying political science here in Bamberg is that you teach and study political science in very small groups. You interact with your teachers and your students in a very familiar atmosphere. You only have very few students in class and therefore you also are able to have a very close contact, very close relationships with your instructors, the professors and the other teachers. Which means that directly after class you can come and talk to us to your research projects and assignment but also during our office hours and afterwards. We're always there for you if you have any questions or want to discuss your research. What strikes uh, me about the science in Bamberg is furthermore that Bamberg is characterized by a very strong empirical focus. We conduct the science research here that is theory guided and very strong in empirical terms. We use cutting edge research techniques, we use very advanced statistical software to conduct our empirical investigations and we also teach this to your students. So you are able to apply those um, theories and test those theories using those cutting edge research techniques in your own work, in your own research assignments and also in your term paper and master thesis. So all in all, Bamberg is a very um, interesting um, institutions to study political science because you have a very uh, favorable teacher and student ratio and you also have a very strong theoretical and empirical focus here which will allow you, allows you to um, study political science at the forefront of the disciplines. Hi, Professor Klufer. Hi. Uh, I'm really interested in the relationship between economic downswing and cabinet stability in contemporary southeastern Europe. Mm -hmm. Could you perhaps give me a letter, literature recommendation about this subject? Yes, actually I'm not myself an expert on the topic, but I know that my colleague Thomas Saffield, okay. he actually just recently published a paper on the topic and he might be a very good help for you. Yeah. So I would recommend that you just go to him straight away and ask him for advice about the topic. Uh, okay, well great, thanks a lot. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Hi, ben. Hi, Professor Salfeld. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Uh, I was actually just coming from Professor Kluver's course. Um, I'm really interested in the politics of cabinet stability, and she mentioned that um, you might be able to have some advice on that topic since you've been doing research in that area recently. Okay, yes, that's right. I've just published a book with some colleagues. Ah, about okay. It. You, here you go. You can have a look at it. Oh, great. Thanks a lot. Tell me what you think about yeah, it. Yeah, definitely. Our university is in a very strong position to offer courses in all major subfields of political science including political theory, comparative politics, international relations, public policy analysis, the study of voting behavior. Our students also get a very solid grounding in research methods and statistics. In addition to that, they can supplement their studies in political science by choosing electives from economics, from business administration, from sociology, history, and other subjects. We're also offering uh, international courses, international double master's courses, um, which allow students at the master's level to study a year in Bamberg and a year at a different university and at the end of that course they will receive two degrees, one degree from the University of Bamberg, one degree from uh, the other partner university. These programs are relatively strongly integrated so students have, um, um, are very, very well looked after in both locations. If you don't speak German um, and still want to take advantage of the educational opportunities that we can offer at the University of Bamberg. You don't have to worry. We do offer a relatively large number of courses in English. Uh, so that should allow you to get your feet on the ground in Bamberg, get used to the environment, and perhaps later on take courses in German. After receiving advice from Professor Saalfeld, I can continue my research with the right focus. The library is located directly on the campus and maintains circa 350,000 books and approximately 1,800 ongoing scientific journals as well as daily and weekly newspapers.
There are 270 workplaces and rooms available for group discussions. Students have online access to the most current academic journals in political science and to the Social Sciences Citation Index. Hey, Francie, how's it going? Hey, Brown. I'm studying for my exams. Okay, how are you doing? Oh, yes, I'm fine, thanks. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, I'm doing okay, thanks for asking. Uh, do you want to go grab a coffee with me, maybe take a break? Yes, of course. All right, let's go. Even though Bomberg is a small university, it has an outstanding learning environment and facilities. Franzi, what stands out to you the most about the University of Bomberg? In my opinion, studying at a small university is a great advantage for students. The walking distances are small and the political science community is very close-knit. We get taught in small groups by scholars with a reputation of international excellence. The political science department prepares you with the necessary theoretical skills and empirical research methods that make you attractive to any employer in the public and private sectors. Yes, indeed. And in addition to that, the profile of future employers can be further developed with practical knowledge. For example, students have the opportunity to participate in the annual National Model United Nations in New York, and I think that's a great experience. All in all, I can say that Bamberg was the right choice for me and my personal goals in life. This is my friend Daniel, who I'm meeting for lunch in the Menza. It's a self-service cafeteria next to the university. Here, students can meet or catch up over an affordable meal or drink. Bamberg is also one of the most beautiful towns in Germany and thus listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1993. The medieval atmosphere makes it an architectural gem. Nestled in the Franconian countryside, Bamberg's location gives it a distinct regional identity although Frankfurt, Munich, Prague, and Nuremberg can easily be reached by train or car. Students can take advantage of the low cost of living expenses and an abundance of cultural events in Bamberg, such as a lively music and club scene. It is always a pleasure to meet up with friends in such great locations. There is a vibrant student life at the University of Bamberg. Student associations of all kinds whether political, cultural, or athletic, are open for all students to join. One outstanding example of such a self-organized student event is the UniCup football tournament that takes place every summer. Has anybody seen Ben lately? Yes, today at the library. Hey guys, how's it hey. going? Hey, hey man, what's up? Um, you're quite late. Sorry about that, yeah. I already ordered beer. Wow, thanks. So, Prost. Prost. Come to Bomberg and study with us. Yeah.